I was slightly nervous because it was a new environment and new people to meet. Straight away, everyone was very accommodating and welcoming. I've really loved it. Um, everyone's been so welcoming and easy to work with. They've allowed me to like ne learn new things really easily and to, like try things that I would never have tried before. I experienced an amazing atmosphere I've never experienced anywhere else. And because everyone's always mixing together and they're always talking and having these meetings, it's like you're really one big team and you don't really feel like each department is isolated from another. Just be positive with everyone. It's how you show up. So when you show up to a meeting, it's how positive you are, it's how engaged you are. And don't be embarrassed. It's never, that's the most important thing, it's just never being embarrassed about asking something even if it sounds silly. This experience has made me want to pursue a career more in F1 because I just see everyone working together and how much of an actual team sport it is. Everyone's been really friendly and really patient because this is my first time using CAD and it's a really complex software. Never feeling a sense of entitlement. The more successful you are, the more humble you are, the most friendly person you are. I'm really interested in the data side of the racing. I'm really passionate about coding and computer science, so that has been really enjoyable for me. Um, I've been learning a bit of JavaScript, HTML, even just going on tours around the building, I've learnt so much. It's very diverse, so you work from schematics to PCB to test and development, and everyone's been so welcoming, even though I'm so new to this. You know, don't get me wrong, racing is fun, but putting it all together is also rewarding. When you go to work experience, you don't expect to be doing stuff that people who have been in the industry for years do. Formula One has always been a pathway I've considered, but after doing this work experience, it's become more something I'm focusing on now. Before it wasn't even in the back of my mind. I didn't consider an option, but now I'm looking into like data jobs or even testing development. I'd quite like to do an apprenticeship or a degree apprenticeship. I definitely wanted to do engineering. I've always wanted to go to university to study engineering, particularly like Imperial. But I've also been looking into degree apprenticeships and apprenticeships as it's like a different way out and you can really get experience your degree at the same time. I've been a part of this STEM programme since year 10. I was part of cohort one and now I'm part of cohort three. So it feels really unreal to actually be here.